Crossing the American border to go shopping in Buffalo or skiing in Ellicottville is something a lot of Canadians do. Now with our dollar at par with the American greenback, cottaging in the States could become a new trend. Finger Lakes is three hours south. The main difference is that you won't battle hours of traffic on Highway 400 to get to your destination. Once you pass the border, it's smooth sailing from there. We have folks that come in through New York State Thruway. There's a couple of different exits depending on what lake you're coming to, and it's an easy drive to the lakes. Traffic's never an issue. Even on a Friday afternoon? Friday, Saturday, mid of summer, it's very easy to get around. Finger Lakes is one of the largest tourism regions in New York State and covers over 2,000 square kilometers from the southern shore of Lake Ontario to the Pennsylvania border. It encompasses 11 parallel healthy lakes with cottages and homes lining them all. Like our first feature story from Muskoka, this time we'll show you what kind of property you can get ranging from $200,000 to $500,000, starting with this two-bedroom cottage on Lake Seneca. This is a 1937 original log home that they've been uh, done an addition on. Uh, it's being offered for $299,000 and has 1,245 square feet. And that's a steal of a deal for this lake. Our average is about 400 for this particular lake. This is price point at 300. So this is a good, uh, you know, first time cottage type uh, type dwelling. In Muskoka, a cottage similar to this size goes for about $307,000. Both are located right on the lake and both are all season homes. Next up, it's a bit of a fixer upper that boasts a lot of promise. This place was built in 1920. 2,353 square feet uh, is being offered for 340,000 and has 70 feet of level lakefront. There's three bedrooms, one and a half baths. The kitchen's a little bit dated. One big benefit of this property is a great big garage so that's super for boat storage and water toys and all that kind of stuff. The cottage we showed you that was about this size in Muskoka costs almost $600,000, but it had been completely rebuilt. In its original state, it likely would have sold for a similar price as this one. Still on Seneca Lake, a cedar frame contemporary style home for $500,000. This one has four bedrooms, two and a half baths. Uh, it's currently a year-round property for these folks, but certainly could easily be a seasonal property for somebody who wants a cottage here. Like the last, the interior is outdated, but the property is quite large. This home sits on a half-acre lot and even has a pool in the back. Until now, Finger Lakes wasn't really mentioned as a hotspot for Canadians looking to buy a cottage. But now that the dollars are equal, it's an area worth checking out. Kate Stutzman, CHCH News, Finger Lakes.